What's up, everybody? It's your host, Marquise, and you're watching MDG Entertainment. So, today we got Tom McDonald, If I Was Black. Man, there's a lot of crap behind this song. Um, just his the company he releases music through, not wanting to release it from um, just they was holding it hostage. And then he released the cover art for the song. I wasn't a fan of the cover art, not because I was offended, just I wasn't a fan of the cover art. Like, <laughs> whatever. But, um,. We here for the song, man, so we're going to check it out. We're going to see what the meaning behind the song is. We're going to give our honest thoughts and opinions. So sit back, buckle in, and enjoy the ride. Let's go. If I was black, probably wouldn't with anyone who's white. Because that slavery would honestly always be on my mind if I was black. Probably wouldn't ever want to drive. Because if police pull me over, I might go around and die. If I was black, I won't lie. I'd be scared to walk at night. The whole neighborhood is tripping like I'm out committing crimes. I'd be pissed at all these. Okay. Um, he made, he made, he made two points. One I agree with, one what I don't. The scared to walk outside because everybody always think you tripping up to something, going to hurt somebody, steal something, kill somebody. That... I can understand, especially if you live in a community what um, where you are the minority. Like, if you like the only few black guys that live there and they always call in the cops, yeah, I would be kind of scared to walk outside. Um, the one po one thing he was like, uh, I wouldn't mess with anybody if I was white because the racist thing will always be on my mind. I don't agree with that. And also, he said in White Boy, like his song White Boy, that you can't, you can't hold that over every white person's head. So it's kind of weird now saying if, well, if he was in our shoes, he actually would hold it over every white person's head. So that's all I'm saying. That's, you know, that, that kind of confused me right there. Uh, I wouldn't expect that coming from Tom because of what he said, like you, how you can't hold it over every white person's head. But let's go. Cracker rappers singing about my life. Stole my music, stole my style. Give it back. That is mine. If I was black, just look at the facts. We don't stand it. Okay, about the rap thing, I can, I can see that too. Um, rap did start in the black community, but I think it's, I mean, I think it's for everybody. Like, yes, it's, it's definitely something that was started and created by the black community, which I think is awesome that it's like now worldwide, like something that was started from black people in America, like, and people thought it was going to go nowhere. People thought it was just going to be a little error. It was going to die out. Um, now it's like one of the biggest things on this planet. And I think that's awesome. Chance one in three is locked away. Over half don't know they dead. See white privilege and a money thing, but it's white people who are running things. Y'all benefit from your coloring. My pigment produce suffering. It's all white. Mm, all that was facts. I ain't, I ain't got nothing to say about that. All that, all that was was the truth. Um, the song is definitely not what I thought it was gonna be so far. He uh, he surprised me. Let's go. Pride, white power, white lies, white houses, white guys, white washing, my brothers, my sisters, my culture while I'm watching. If I was black, I'd probably hate myself from they say racism made me racist and I am not the one to blame. Hey, y'all won't say it to my face. In the circles, you feel safe. Y'all been using words they made for us when we were slaves. Hey, mm. hey, wait, whoa. I know that was long ago. If I was black, I'd want my reparation money paid. If I was black, I'd take the police. I'd take hey. the whole plan. My nigga, Tom, let me find out you trying to get invited to the motherfucking barbecues, fam. Like, hold it on. He said that I don't think every cop is, is, is bad, of course. I Personally, I never call the cops. That's just because I just, I deal with shit myself. But, um... That hook was nice, bro. Especially, especially the clan part and the goals in the in, in the teeth. So if you think I'm broke, you'll know when I speak, bro. I got money. I got them diamonds in my teeth. Broke where, my guy? Broke where? So I like that. I like that. And um, always fuck the clan. You can fight me on that one. I don't care. Fuck the clan. We gonna bring that one back. We gonna bring that one back. Long ago, if I was black, I'd want my reparation money paid. If I was black, I'd take the police, I'd take the whole plan, I'd put holes in their sheets. If I was black, I'd put gold on my teeth. So if you think I'm broke, you will know when I speak. If I was black, it's my face on a T, R I P on the knee, throw my name hey. free. If I was black, I would die in these streets just to speak in my mind because I had a dream. Mm. If I was black, 
I was. Okay, man, he's speaking. He's speaking some truth, man. He's speaking some truth. Like I like, I like the cover art, but I guess that was the that was a tactic to maybe throw people off. Um, I mean, the whole. Like I said, the first part about it, son getting screened that the whole first part, like I said, I wouldn't blame every white person for slavery. Um, but so so far when most of it I'm, I'm agreeing with. Most of it I'm agreeing with. Let's go. I was black, probably wouldn't ever do my taxes. Why support a government to persecute my blackness? Or pay the wage of law enforcement, putting us in caskets, or help to build the prisons that we trapped in. If I was black, I'd be mad. People glorify the trap while we dying every day, fighting for everything we have. It ain't diamond chains of racks. This is systematic plan. They put us in the ghetto, gave us HIV and crack. If I was black, I'd hate America. Appropriate my character. Okay, okay. I wouldn't say I would hate America. Um, because black people in had had played played a big part in help building America, so uh, I feel like it's as much as ours and it is you know anybody else's as well. So I would just want America to um to be better, and which it is now. I think America is is definitely a better place. Um, he mentioned something about white privilege earlier, and uh, personally, me, I think white privilege is a thing just because I see it happen. Um, but I don't think it's like so bad to where. All because some people get treated uh, specially sometimes, it will affect my life. Like, it doesn't affect my life and it doesn't help hold me back. So, it, you know, I don't really care. Like, if some dude get babyfied, whatever, that don't affect me. But um, I, I do understand that, you know, you know, back in the day, way before I was born, probably way before my mom was born, um, the government was uh coming up with these things to flood drugs and just all kinds of negativity stuff in these minority communities uh not say minority just because it wasn't black it was the mexicans and and, and and more just any minority community they could you know just to keep those people down um within the country so and you definitely had the freedom fighters and stuff like that to try to you know that that foot against that so that was good and, and stuff like that. He had uh, uh, some people in the government tried to help us, but most of them was just quiet and they just they stayed out of it. They didn't have anything to do with it. They didn't want to get involved. Um, but now today, I don't think our government is like that. You have tons of minorities in there. You have tons of people looking out for the minority communities on both sides, Democrat and Republican. So that um, but so. I don't, I don't know, but I, I do know it's, it is it is definitely people that's alive that did experience that, so I can see why they, they hold that chip, you know, on that so shoulder, because they, they had to live through that. Me, I didn't have to live through that. Like, yes, it was it was definitely messed up, and it should have never happened to uh, to begin with, but, you know, that's that's just not something I can speak on, because I didn't live through it, but, I mean, all because you ain't, you ain't lived through it, you know, you can, you can still clearly tell it was messed up, but let's go. And sell it to Caucasians who wish they were from my area. If I was black, I wouldn't give a fuck about the greater good. My grandma can't afford a rent. Y'all gentrified our neighborhood. Our lives matter so stupid. Y'all hijacking our movement. Black lives matter. Okay, okay. All lives matter is <laughs> just was formed. All lives matter was formed just to go against Black Lives Matter. And uh, everybody say Black Lives Matter is a terrorist group and all that. Um... I don't think it is. I don't think Black Lives Matter is a terrorist group. You got some dumb people that do dumb stuff and then be like, oh, I'm with Black Lives Matter. Even though the organizations of that community, I mean, comes out publicly and say, no, that guy was not with us. He was, he was not a part of our organization. He's not a part of our movement. Uh, Black Lives Matter is actually very organized uh, if you actually research them. Um, they are not the new KKK. Like, I don't see why people are saying that, like, the KKK was an organization that was coming out publicly saying, like, no, we hate black people. Well, not even just black people. But I'm going to use black people as an example. Like, we hate black people and we will kill them. But, you know, they're not, Black Lives Matter is not as an organization coming out saying, like, oh, we hate white people or cops, so we're going to kill them or whatever. Um, I see what Alfie said. I want the, oh, the, the, uh, you know, grandma can't pay her bills. You know, I, I want to care about the greater good. 
the best thing to do in that situation, I know it's always easier and fast money to pick up a bag or do something, uh, breaking the law to where you can get quick cash to help your family members out. But the, but, but the chances of getting caught is very high if you don't, if you're not smart enough to do it in a way you're not going to get caught. And that's going to hurt their heart even more. That's going to break their heart even more and that's going to affect their health. So the best thing you can do on that is to get a damn job. So no, I disagree with that. Black people, if, if, Tom, if you was black, I do not recommend you do doing that, bro. Like, get a job. Get a goddamn job. <laughs> like, let's go. Cause we lose it, innocent youth, the pony shootings. If I was black, the only role models I'm shown is the rich black rappers pushing guns and drugs and hoes. Yeah, hey, y'all won't say it to my face. In the circles, you feel safe. Y'all been using words they made for us when we were slaves. Hey, uh, hey I love this wait, whoa, I know that was long ago. If I was black, I'd want my reparation money paid. If I was black, I'd take the police, I'd take the whole plan, I'd put holes in their sheets. If I was black, I'd put gold on my teeth. So if you think I'm broke, you will know when I speak. If I was black, it's my face on a T. Hey. I'll be underneath on hey. my name next to free. Hey. If I was black, I'd hey. die in these streets just for speaking my mind because I had a dream. Hey. If I was black, you'd attack when I say I'm proud because you're mad that you ain't allowed. If I was black, Y'all ever tried to take me down One fist in the air I would stay in my ground If I was hey. black, I'd take the police I'd take the whole clan I'd put holes in their sheets If I was black, I'd put gold on my teeth So if you think I'm broke You will know when I speak If I was black, it's my face on a T All I'd be underneath On my name next to free If I was black, I would die in these streets Just to speak in my mind Because I had a dream Hey man, hey I fuck. Hey, overall, over overall, did I fuck with the song? Yes, I fucked with the song overall. I wasn't a now. Some stuff that I disagree with, absolutely. Some stuff like I said, the 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 you know, not messing with white people because of racism. Nah, the whole you know, forget the greater good when your family. Uh, your grandmother can't pay her bills. Now, like, like I said, some stuff in the song I disagree with. Um, but the overall message of the song, I'm fucking with it. He, uh, I mean, he said like if he was black, I mean, if he was black, he would basically be all about black power. He would be, he would, he would, he would be about doing what he got to do to take care of his family. He would be, he would, he, he fuck all the racism, the cops, and and all that. I mean, if there's some people like that, I don't, I don't think that'll make them a bad guy. They just it's all about the black community. Um, so, yeah. Song definitely not what I thought it was going to be, man. Especially with that cover art. Still not a fan of the cover art. But, um, yeah, that, that that was a nice-ass song. And it's weird because he didn't show the cover art that was in the actual video. I thought he would, but he didn't. And he never threw up the black uh, the black power sound like one time. I, he actually, like, he didn't. I thought Tom was going to do it. Like, he didn't do it. I was actually looking forward for Tom throwing up Black Power. <laughs> like, I'm not even going to lie to you. I thought it was been the funniest shit ever, man. But, nah, he was he was definitely jamming, man. And, uh, Tom, you invited to the cookout, fam. You invited to the cookout, man. Bring bring your, bring your white self with your goat, with your grill, with your braids to the cookout, fam. Good Texas cookout. Man, y'all let me know what y'all think about that song. Um, I know it's going to open up a discussion because, I, I, like I said, I disagree with some stuff that he say in there. Um... Don't fuck with Tom, though. Then this was definitely a good song. Myth led me by the cover art, like I said, but didn't, didn't expect the song to be like this, but it was dope. And y'all let me know what y'all think. I'll catch y'all later. Peace.